Hello y'all, hi, this is Allie Cochran. Thank you for coming and stopping by my channel. I just got a new release that came out and I'm kind of excited to share with y'all because this is my first video. But I haven't found anybody that did any video release about this new card holder. It's a Louis Vuitton card holder released July 31st and I just got it yesterday. It is called the Recto Verso. See this little thing? It's a card holder. So it's not really a wallet, but I would say it's a mini wallet. But it's pretty decent size. I have small hands, but it's pretty thin, fits nicely. It has a flap button, or what do you call it? A brass button with the uh, flap, and all the black inside is leather flat pocket and this flap actually wraps around to the inside so it's just like one piece going in and this hidden pocket right in the middle like you can store cash or receipts for that day I don't like to keep receipts on me so just use till I get home I take them out but that's a pretty good size so now you have that flap pocket this hidden pocket right and it only opens from the top to the side on one side. So it's got this beautiful brass, super shiny, look at that, zipper. And it only goes to one side. So, see it's just flat here, and then it goes like this. See it, so it's not thick, completely down it's just like a, like a V so it gives you some space to open it up as wide as you can so inside it's the same black leather all the way in it has a key ring so you can hook it to like the backpack all that wouldn't for safety reasons unless you're you put it on, like, on your belt loop um because it has those card slots right here one two three and four four card slots. There, you can see it better. So, let's see what it holds. You know, and this came out in the U.S. Uh, $590 and there's tax. So it's about like $635 total. But, uh, kind of steep for what it is, a card holder. But again, it's Louis Vuitton and when I saw this flat pocket, I saw the zipper, I saw the key ring, I saw these slots, I was like, yes. I was thinking about the key class, which is a little smaller, and it just, is this on top, and that's it. And that's like one third of the price of this one. But it's just so cute. Anyway, let's see what it holds. Let's see what fits inside. So let's see, we'll just put an in and out gift card and cargers. We'll just do those. So two in there. Two. Still flat. Okay. I have a 20. So we'll just stuff that inside here. I'm sure you could fit more in there. Like if you always carry a lot of cash, then you can put them inside here folded, but otherwise I wouldn't recommend it. It's not a full size wallet, so I wouldn't overstretch it. So inside, I'm gonna put a stack of cards inside. And you have more space if you take out the key ring. in there so that's actually 10 plus the two in the front it's 12 then I have four more so that's a total of 16 I'm gonna put them in it's kind of tight because I just got this yesterday
my four most used cards. I'm just gonna put them on the front. That's how it works. A little fat because I have 10 cards inside, two in here, four in here. 16 cards, that holds as much as a full-size wallet, 16 cards. Um, but I'm not going to do it. Do you see how it kind of like pulls? It's kind of going like this way because it's pretty stretched out. And I don't want to stretch it out. I'm not using it as a full-size wallet anyway. So I wouldn't use that there's 10, but it can hold 10. I probably, if I needed to, probably do like, let's do half. One, two, two, three, four, five. Let's do five. And if you do like five cards inside, you could fit your key ring. And it's not stretching out, I don't think. No, it's not. You can kind of see the indentation from this first slot. So if you take it out my Costco, and then it flattens back out. Let's see. I don't know. I mean, that's what it's for. I'm, I might just use it. I worry about stretching it out, but then I mean, that's what I'm gonna use it for. So that's the four. And then holds my 20. So put your notes. You take out your key ring. You could probably put some keys on there too. I tried my key fob, but it's too fat. I have a Honda key fob. But yeah, this looks so good. And compared to my six key holder I have, see this, this is be too fat because this thing is not very wide, look at that. So if you put it inside, it's, I, you wouldn't be able to close it. I don't think, I don't think I've tried it. Take out these cards. Okay, I mean you could, it would close, but it'd be bulking up and puckering the zipper. And I don't want to do that. I don't want to be pulling at the seams because you don't want to make it disproportioned. And then when you stretch it out, it's not going to look good. You know, you want it to last as long as you can. They don't last forever, but they are pretty durable. But anyway, so I would not recommend a key fob like this, like this big. But you can fit in regular keys. And I don't have that many keys. I just literally have two, like my house key and my mail key, and then my Honda key. And then school pictures of both my beautiful girls. And that's how I carry my six key ring. And a whole six, I mean, before I had this that came in, I was using this back part. See? It's literally just like a slot. And you can fit. Let's see what I can use. Fit two or three cards back there. You can get your license, really easy, and credit card or insurance card. So I'll show you my library card, put it inside, and this goes right behind it, and it closes. One or two. After that, if you put more than two, then it starts seeing the line, just like I was talking about on this one. See that? And I didn't want that on my six key. But I love this, but they do not work the same. So you could put your keys inside here, but again, just not the big fob. Like you put your keys, and it would hold. So I'm really impressed with this. It holds a lot. Like I said, it can hold 16. Poss I only put two in the front, but you could probably fit four. Let me try adding two more. So I have one, two, three, four. Okay, so you can fit four. Ooh, it's 18. I add two more. Two. 
Okay, so this little thing can fit 20 cards. Oh my gosh. 20. But I don't want to put that much in there because I'm not using the full full wallet. But you can. 20. They're just going to have that little, looks kind of fat look. <laughs> Poofing out. See how it goes like this? For space. But yes, awesome. I think it's worth it. Um, first I was on the fence, but if you're gonna use it every day, I think it's worth it. Uh, I wanted something that would fit inside my latest edition for Mother's Day, my Palm Springs PM backpack. And it fits great. It does not fit in the front pocket, just so you know if you have this backpack. It does not because look, it is the same size as that front pocket. Like you couldn't even turn it off lengthwise. You can't, it will not let you. But you can take out, put it in that back pocket because it's got such a beautiful glaze, glazing around it. I don't want to scratch it up so I can just put it back there. See? And then it's protected and I can put my gum and my pusher accessories inside. I think that's how it. I was using my Clements wallet, but the Clements wallet with my pochette, because it's a full-size wallet, it's here, but I feel like I'm always worried about this tab bending and stuff, and I just got that replaced, and I want it nice, because it's the limited edition hot pink color. So. But yeah, you can't even tell, it's way back there. So now I can just downsize and I wanted a lightweight bag. I don't want to carry around something heavy. So I just got my little hand held carry and then my gum and a pochette with my hand sanitizer. What else I have back there? Oh, face mask. So yes, just in case. And there's my clear one too. I got on Etsy. I just tie, I just uh, tie it on the back. So when I'm ready to go, like I don't want to squish the plastic, but I love it and it fits inside. So thank you so much for watching and I hope this helped you make a decision because this is like a key class on steroids. Right. Now, if you're worried about this, these cards coming out, it's not, it's really tight. It was tight for me going in and out and I would only suggest putting in one card in each slot because it is leather. You could put two in the front pocket, but again, I don't want the line around here, the indentation, so I'm just doing strictly one for each, and it's not gonna fall out at all. So if you had to do some quick errands, just grab your phone, grab this, you can. Um, I highly recommend it. And at first, you know, I was like, oh my gosh, $590, and then with tax, but there's nothing else like it, and um, I'm pretty happy with it, so I'm going to keep it. So, thanks for watching. Love y'all.